Hello, my name is Jason Dragon. I've been on YouTube now for over 12 years, but I've never really decided to do a video blog until today. So this is video blog number one. So here we are. I'm going to talk to you about a lot of different things. I haven't really done a video blog in the past because I don't want to be talking about the same thing over and over and over again. For a long time, I've and I know in uh, for a long time I basically made cryptocurrency videos. And when you make cryptocurrency videos and you get a good following of cryptocurrency type people who want to watch those videos, and then you do a video on real estate you lose a third of your followers and it's not really exciting. I'm like, well, I don't really want to make a video because I'm going to lose more people than I'm going to gain. It's really annoying. So I am going to be talking about cryptocurrency. I'm going to talk about it at least once a week. So if you're a cryptocurrency person, don't delete this channel. You're going to have some good stuff coming up here soon. But I am going to talk about other things. I am going to take all the cryptocurrency stuff that I post and tag it with the hashtag cryptocurrency. So you'll be able to, if you just want to watch those, you can watch those. And if it's about, you know, going to Disney World or something, uh, you won't be able to see that. So because of that, I haven't really wanted to do that. I'm also very, very busy. I, I understand that a lot of these YouTubers, they monetize their channels. They make enough money off their channels that they don't actually have to have a job. But, you know, I have a job. I actually have two jobs, you know. And I run a family of, with three kids, and it's just crazy. I'm full-time busy. So I'm going to produce videos, but... You know, they're not always going to be the best quality. They're not going to be the best level of editing. They're not going to be, you know, I mean, I have some pretty good equipment, but I might not always be using the best equipment. I might be just be going out there gonzo style with my cell phone and making some really cool video going live on Facebook or going live on YouTube. Um, that's really fun. Uh, for So I started my, my YouTube back in 2007, but all the way back in 2003, I actually started a blog on WordPress originally, wordpress.org, before, you know, people were really even doing blogs. And that blog, I, there was, I posted about 300 articles on that. All those articles are still online at thebizguy.com, uh, T-H-E-B-I-Z-G-U-Y. Um, but I haven't really been posting a lot lately. I... I, I really find it that there's a lot of really excellent content out there in the world. And if I don't feel that I have something to add to the conversation or, you know, or there's a lot of really good coverage, better coverage than, than I would have the time or the patience to do, then I'd rather just refer you to that better coverage. Because it makes no sense for me to cover something that somebody else is covering better. I'll just say, hey, go look at them. They're doing a great job. Um, you know, there's so many good YouTubers out there and so many good things going on. Um, I don't want to take their steam at all. So I want to I want to basically make this video blog um, for, you know, and what I've done in my blog in the past is covering things that aren't well covered. You know, covering, um, like back when, a, a crypto, when Ethereum mining first started, you know, I figured out a way to do it a little bit better and more efficiently. I built a whole Facebook channel about that. I built a, a tools page uh, really trying to help people because nobody was out there just plainly saying how to mine for Ethereum cryptocurrency. It wasn't like a, a thing. And then later on, you know, after I did mine, um, some people came out and they made some really good videos. And then I said, well, you know, they're doing, you know, they have the time and they have the energy to do that. I want to just let them do that. Um, I do have a lot of things to say on the, the matter, and I will be talking about that here uh, very, very shortly. So let me go over there and uh, show you kind of the things we're going to be talking about on this video blog over the next year or so. I am going to try to post as often as I can, um, maybe daily. I'm going to definitely try to get at least four or five in every week. Um, I'm not always going to be here at my home office wearing, you know, just a, a, a t-shirt. I'm going to be, you know, at my office dressed in my normal office clothes. And I'm going to be, you know, as I said before, out in the field <laughs> doing fun stuff. Um, right now I'm just using OBS just to f put up this quick little video. I'm just doing a uh, web capture and, and desktop capture, you know, basic Microsoft Word. Um, I've done a lot of videos like that in the past that were highly successful, but I am going to be doing uh, some videos that I actually spend some time editing and making them, you know, music and all the cool stuff. So let me go over, over here. 
So the first thing we're going to be talking about is cryptocurrency. Um, I have to do that because I have a lot of people who subscribe to this group. I have a lot of friends that that's one of their number one things they want to talk about. And it happens to be something I'm fairly much of an expert at. So I'm going to be doing a, at least one blog a week video blog about cryptocurrency. So if you subscribe to my channel for that reason, don't unsubscribe. You're going to have some good content coming your way. I'm going to do a couple little re researching about ROI, uh, business uses, other information about cryptocurrency that I've found out. I'm also going to be talking a lot about technology. As you know, I run Emerald Computers. I run Arizona Computer Recycling. Um, what we do is we take computers and we recycle them. And every single day I'm looking at old computers. I'm looking at new computers. We just built a state-of-the-art gaming machine yesterday. Um, we're constantly building and selling the nicest technology along with refurbing the old technology. And one of the things that I've mastered is figuring out how to get the most bang for the buck. You know, where do we figure out, if you want to spend $600 on a computer, I ask you what you want to use it for, and then I will build you the best computer for $600 and show you exactly how to do that. That's what my expertise is at. That's what I've done my, built my business around. Um, but I'm definitely going to be talking about different, you know, everything from VR technology um, to, you know, future technology to solar technology. Um, anything that comes to computers. I'll uh, probably even talk a little bit about cell phone technology. Um, I wish, you know, wish they would send me free stuff so I can definitely review it. I think I have, I could definitely do a better review than most of those people who I'm watching reviews. Um, you know, I have the OnePlus 5T still. This had this phone 18 months now. Oh my gosh. This phone is still the most awesome phone I've ever owned. It's still better than almost any phone that all my friends have. It's, it's just a work of art. Anyway, we're also gonna be talking a lot about business. Business is what my degree is in. Business is my passion. Business is what I do. You know, I run a computer business because I love technology and I know about technology. But I could earn a lot more money probably working for some big technology firm, but I do this for the passion of running a business, for the freedom of running a business, for the freedom of being able to say, hey, you know, it's you know three o'clock in the afternoon, let's go pick up my kid at school and take the rest of the day off and have some fun. Or heck, you know, hey, I just got a free uh, two night stay over in Vegas. Let's uh, just you know take the next two days off and go to Vegas and you know I'll be able to do business on the phone and every time I do that it turns out great. Um, running and running my own business is probably one of the most integral parts to my life um, you know because that pretty much defines how I function and how I work in this world. Um, you know if I was just focused on technology all day long, I would be very bored. <laughs> so I don't do that. Next, we're gonna talk about family. Of course, you know, I do a lot of fun stuff with my kids, a lot of stuff, fun stuff with my wife. Um, you know, I, we, we went to Disney World last year. We're, we're gonna be going um, probably to Disneyland this year. Don't tell the kids. Um, We've been to Vegas quite a few times. We go on lots of fun trips. Uh, we're hoping to go to maybe Rocky Point this year. I don't know. I don't know if I want to go to Mexico anymore. Um, but anyway, a lot of fun stuff. But, you know, also not just the trips, but just the day-to-day -day fun of, you know, what do the kids think about this? What You know, what's life like for a 10-year-old? You know, I'm going to definitely be interviewing them and having some video blogs with them. I think that'll be quite a lot of fun. So I'm going to talk about real estate. I love real estate. I, I'm also a realtor. Um, I didn't really become a realtor to make money doing real, to being, being a realtor. I mostly became a realtor so I could learn and about more, way more about real estate and get my foot into doors where places that if you're not a realtor, you don't get your foot into that door. Um, being able to, you know, be in on a commercial real estate transaction and being able to help 
negotiate and have a seat at the negotiating table. That's something being a realtor gets me in on on the you know lets me lets me have a seat at that table. I, I have a lot of ideas about the i buyers that are coming up about the future trends in real estate. Um, I have a lot to talk about about that. We're going to talk about that a lot in our in this in this um, blog. I am going to take. All these different topics I'm going to be talking about in the future, I am going to be putting them in different lists and different f folders. So when you subscribe to my channel and you only want to hear about real estate, you can easily, you know, just look at the real estate posts. Or you could just look at the technology posts or the cryptocurrency posts. Um, Beyond that, I have a lot of ideas on how-to videos, life hacks. I'm going to give you a one little one right now. Um, like, I just recently learned. And, you know like on your credit report. Credit utilization is a really, really important thing. We all know that, I've known that forever. Um, you wanna try to keep it 30%. It's okay to go above, if you go above 30% with some of the profiles, they start really dinging your credit score. If you go above 50%, that's another threshold, they start dinging your credit score. And then if you go much above that, you're really bad. But one mistake I was doing, and I didn't realize I was doing this mistake, just being honest here, um, I had some, I have a whole bunch of zero interest credit cards. So I was, I was like, well, it's like free money to invest in my business. So I had those almost maxed out and my, all my other credit cards that have higher interest, I pretty much had a zero balance on. And that was actually killing, um, in a lot of these, my, it was killing my credit score. And I found out and I looked into it and I found out that basically if any card is over 90% utilization, you get a major ding on your credit score from that. So in the last week, I've basically paid off even all my 0% credit cards that were above 90% usage. I've paid them down so they're less than 90% of the limit. I've also been able to pay off a few other credit cards to zero. So um, I know that's not helpful, but I just don't want to have to deal with those people anymore. So um but there's a lot of other how-to life hacks. I'm going to talk about life hacks about a lot of computer things, a lot of how-to things. Um, being in the technology area and being like a you know somebody that somebody that a lot of people ask questions of, I'm constantly bombarded by questions from people of how to do this and how to do that and how to and, you know all these different issues. So I'm going to go through and make sure that you know if a lot of people are asking me how do I you know, how, like, how do I set up a VPN? You know, that's a very good, valid question. Well, I'm going to make a YouTube video on that. I know there's some YouTube videos out there, but my customers don't seem to get those. And I'm definitely going to be, make, you know, I'm not going to be one of those people who makes videos where they start typing everything. That's very, very annoying. Like half the how-to videos are more than half now. The people just play music. They don't even talk. And then they just type all the instructions on the screen. I'm like... Like, who decided that that would be a good format? Anyway, um, we're going to watch YouTube videos together. I love watching YouTube videos. I spent, you know, probably more time than I should watching YouTube videos. Um, but, you know, we have the ability to watch them. I'll be in a little box on the corner. I might have a couple of my friends have little boxes. And we're all going to watch the YouTube videos together and laugh about it. That's one of the, the big things I do with my friends. Uh, they come over. We all watch YouTube. It's kind of fun. But we're also going to play video games together. Um, <clears throat> I did recently get the HTC Vive Pro. And it came with, you know, the handsets, the headset. Uh, HTC Vive Pro. We're going to have that. Um, be able to show videos for, um, you know, I play City Skylines. That's my number one go-to game on the PC. That's a really, really good game. I do play a couple games on my phone. Uh, phone games are fun. So we're definitely going to be playing games together. Um, we're also going to talk about politics. I have a lot of stuff to say about politics. And you might be surprised at what I'm going to say. Um, the number one thing that I want to get across is that, you know, we're not that different from each other. We're all... You know, we're all here trying to do good for our family. We're all here trying to do good. Well, I think the majority of people are here trying to do good for America. And we just have different ways of, of going about it. And we're listening to different sources. And 
those sources are trying to divide us. And I'm going to talk a lot about that and a lot about how we can overcome the division here in America. I, I, I you know, I'm going to try, try to explain it as much as I can. It's really an issue that I'm passionate about trying to get people to, you know, work together. I, I, it, you know, it rips me apart seeing what our country is becoming and how bad our country is and how, you know, people misunderstanding the other side and vilifying the other side is, is happening. And it's, you know, I, I do, you know, I'm not going to say they're always right. Um, but there's a lot that can be done and we just need to go together and talk together. So anyway, um, what else am I going to do on this video blog channel? I have a lot of different equipment. I have uh, the camera we're watching right now, which is uh, my high-end Logitech webcam. I have my high-end Olympus camera right here. I have the input from my VR set, input from my desktop from when I'm browsing the internet doing software with you guys. I have the um, input from video game streaming that I can do. Um, I have my high-end Lenovo laptop. I have my... Uh, Surface Pro that we can take videos of, uh, of course, which half my videos are going to be from my cell phone. So of course I have my cell phone. I'm still rocking the um, OnePlus 5T. Gotta love that OnePlus 5T. It's well, it's definitely the best phone I ever had. But I'm like totally shocked at how. I mean, I've had this phone now for 18 months, and it's still super fast, super awesome battery life. Um, the screen is still perfect. I mean, I, I gave up on the screen protector a year ago, and there's not even like a major scratch on my entire screen. It's, you know, very, very nice. I do have the little itty bitty flimsy thing here. Um, I do have the little cool spinny thing. I can spin my whole phone. I do it all the time. Um, gonna definitely be posting videos from my phone. I have another office like this at my actual work. I'm gonna be um, have the same webcam there, um, a, a similar computer. Uh, similar, you know, Ikea cubes in the background. So I'll be definitely posting videos from there. Um, what else? I have a dash cam on my car, which is really cool. So we, I have a, a couple, I have a thermal camera. I'm going to be playing around with that. Um, we did a couple videos of cryptocurrency mining with thermal imaging, and that was really cool. Um, definitely going to be playing around with the thermal camera. Uh, definitely going to be playing around with um, I have this endoscopic camera, which is like, a, it's on this really long bendy pole and it's, you know, gosh, it's super small. You can actually, well, I won't do it. You can stick it like in your ear or down your throat. Actually, I did do those. Um, there is a video on YouTube posted about two years ago where I actually posted that. I don't know if it's, I don't think it's public. Um, I think I have to send people invites to let them see that video. But anyway. Um, I hope you like, I hope you subscribe. If you're already subscribed, I really hope that you just stay subscribed. If, you know, these other topics are not interesting to you, you know, oh, let's see, oh, they're on this side. Nope, this side. Oh my gosh, this side. Um, if they're not interesting to you, um, of course you can just skip that. Well, thanks and have a good day. 2019, Easter. Day one of video blog. And we're going to stop.